Hi, it's just Moment Tube. Today I'm where the hunter. We're at Aurora Shores and we're testing out the brand new update 1.23, which is on the dev branch at the minute for testing. You can access it, but it'll be going live shortly soon. Once they know it's been tested and it's all fine. I wanted to come on for one of these, an albino wood bison. They've also added a melanistic fur variation for the Alaskan moose. So can't wait to see these i thought i'd come on try and get one of the two and this is what we found first i've never had a rear fur variation in way of the hunter so i'm over the moon we've got the 338 we're going to try and take him out hopefully we'll find a melanistic moose at one point i'm just so happy to find one of these i thought like we'll check all down this sort of river area because there's a lot of moose and wood bison i hunt this area for wood bison quite a lot i've done a few missions here I've done a few videos there actually and i thought we'll check there and then we'll go to a few other locations at the top of the map there's a road right at the top of the map and there's quite a lot of wood bison up there so i've been going here and then up there and, and just checking about seeing what i could find and I was, I was on my last hunt of the day actually and i thought you know what we'll have one last go and then i'll go and make dinner and i, I walked over here and i thought I can't believe it. there's actually now been a wood bison there. <laughs> I didn't think we'd actually find one. But I thought I'd come and check the update out anyway. Because there's lots of changes. And uh, we have all been waiting a couple of months for it. But it's a big update so it needs to be tested. And that's why it's on the dead branch first. You'd rather have it right than wrong. So it has a lot of good testing. Hopefully we don't mess this up. That's a small... No. Oh no. I shouldn't have said that shouldn't have messed it up <laughs> that was a small amount of blood on the floor I was concentrating on all my videoing and just checking a few things out on the screen and I should have concentrated more on the shot as I always say my way to hunter videos if I mess up you're gonna see it it's not gonna be edited I could have edited this out tracked it down and then gone after it but nope we messed it up so yes even ron messes up now the thing is i know the locations where they roughly go they normally go to that river over the other side of that sort of um mountain in front of us or to my right so we'll go over and check the blood i don't think it's a very good shot you could see there's only a little patch on the floor so we've got to try and not spook them anymore and then go over to the right I think they'll be over to the right because that's where they often go. But look at that blood. There's not much there. So that is not a kill shot. So while the 338 is an absolute beast and smashes everything, you can still mess up with it with a bad shot. So always take your time. I'll take my own advice. <laughs> but we'll have to track him down. Try and get another shot on him. Makes it more interesting, I think, actually. I'm real. Not every time do you make perfect shots. You're going to mess up sooner or later, but look at that. That's nothing. That's a mere flesh wound. But which way did he go? I think they went like forward and then dashed to the right. But I couldn't see if he went behind this ridge. I seen someone running over the top, but I think he went down and then round to my right. Yeah, it looks like he's hooked round. can be quite hard when you get little flesh wounds because it's not as easy to find the tracks but once you've played a little bit you get the sort of gist for it do you know what i mean you, you go off your gut and you, you kind of know where it might go but yeah i think he's gone like sort of to the my right he's either gone near the river straight in front of us or over more to the right we should find him quite soon hopefully i've never seen him go that way behind us i'm just checking they weren't enough blood anyway, so he's definitely not dead. So we should get another shot at it. You live and learn, they say. <laughs> what have you been at to? Oh, I'm Wade the Hunter. Let me know in the comments. Are you looking forward to this update, 1.23? I can't wait for it to go live. And get some more trophy animals. I had a five-star elk the other day, one of my most wanted trophies. I've got another five-star animal hunt coming up in a new video. Uh, that'll probably be Wednesday, so that's another great video, I enjoyed that, it was a lot of fun, I'm starting to get some of the trophy animals now, filling some of my trophy lodges up, I don't know where we'll put this one actually, this won't carry over to live either, so, be interesting, 
we'll have to go out and get another one but i don't mind i just want to see what they look like i've never seen a rain where the hunter i've seen people post pictures on where the hunter discord for example people who's got them but i've never actually seen one myself i am currently uh herd managing my white tail i'd love to get an albino white tail doesn't have to even be a big one just an, an albino would be nice so i think they're over this way what we don't want to do is spook them again now they're normally down here near this river area where the sort of bridge is if you know this location but we're quite a way away but if i got on this highest point on my right they're not over here we can have a look over there if you want to see any content for way the hunter let me know in the comments what you want to see do you want any guides do you want me to go after a specific animal certain mission i've been doing all the missions and every time i do a mission objective i always record it so also in this one i can't believe it my black ram mission right which has been bugged for quite a few months should be able to be completed now it's supposed to be fixed in this update so we'll have to go revisit that one can't wait to do that can't see him over here so where are they like i say the last thing i want to do is spook them again because they'll be right over far away if we do that again let them calm down a bit and then try and find them one trophy animal I would really like is a five-star moose. Uh, I think the biggest one I've had is a three-star. I don't think I've even had a four-star yet. So at some point, we're going to have to go after a five-star moose. I know I've got a few three-stars knocking about, but no fives. Not yet. That will come. What's your most wanted trophy animal in Way of the Hunter? Let me know in the comments. Also, which is your favourite rear fur variation you've seen up to yet? Hopefully we'll see the rear wood bison in a minute. <laughs> we find them. Oh, there he is. Right. So he's right over that side near the car park. So I'll mark that so we know how far to go from them. What I generally do is I can still run or jog if I'm after a target animal. I marked it. I know roughly when I'll spook him. About 200 meters, 250 to 200 meters, I'll sort of slow down. And I'll start crouch walking, taking it steady. You're normally good with that. Some animals will spook a little easier. I don't know why, but black bears, elk, wolves as well. They tend to spook quite easy. I'm hoping they add some more objective missions as well. Because I've done most of them. Uh, I've got a few on Transylvania left. One is the five-star jackal one, which I'm dreading. I've got a few on Nez Perce Valley. Um, so I have done a lot of the missions objectives. I'm hoping to get some new ones. I'm looking forward to uh, checking that Black Ram mission out because I've been waiting so long to do that. And I need to check to see if it's fixed. So, do we go over the bridge or can we go in the water and over? To work out our sort of how we're going to do this. Always try and do this before if you see a trophy animal you want. Try and work out beforehand what you're going to do, where you want to position yourself. Uh, get a good vantage point to shoot it from and it makes the shot a whole lot easier just don't do like what i first did <laughs> everyone does it at some point you can rip me in the comments if you want i don't mind so we've got the river here can we cross this river i know you can go over the bridge but we're getting sort of close by the time i get to that bank on the other side we might be under 200 meters and we might spook him again i don't want to spook him again because he'll fly he'll be miles away again and it's not really an ideal position to take the shot i don't mind the long distance if you've probably seen my videos i've shot up to a thousand meters on animals so i'm not bothered about if the shot's nice and easy and clean then it's not too bad but that position of that animal is not very good at all I think we might have to go over the bridge or can we we might better get over here at this the shallowest bit but we will be very close to where i don't like to be standing or walking normally look we're getting close to the 200 meter mark so when we get over this bank we might be just under always thinking ahead 
what's going to be the next new map? A lot of people are saying Australia. A lot of people are saying Africa. I have no idea, but I don't mind any of those two. You never know. It might be just somewhere totally curveball, you know what I mean? Somewhere you're not expecting. But those are the two main ones that people keep saying. But it shouldn't be long. It should be out before August, I think. So we definitely know there's a new map coming soon. I can't wait to see what it is. I wonder what new animals we'll get. Bows, they're often requested. I would like to know about bows myself. I think they are being worked on, but they're very tricky to make in video games. But that is my number one addition, content-wise, after a map I'd like added. So, oh, it's just turning. Ideal. A little closer than I want, but they're not spooked. We took our time. Yes, you stay there. Here it goes. Let's not mess this up. There we go. That's what we should have done the first time. <laughs> in his dad. Our first rear in Way of the Hunter. And it's an albino wood bison. Right, let's run over and collect him. Can't wait to see what they look like. We'll mount him in the uh, trophy lodge as well. See what it looks like on a trophy man. I have put my save from my live on to dev. But um, I won't be transferring it back. Just in case there's any issues. But it'll be nice to have a look at him. So you can all see what he looks like. But here we go. You can't mistake him, that's for sure. Take a few pictures. you have to bear with me a minute. Because uh, this might be the... A thumbnail for the video. I wish it was the other way round. Just use the uh, the cam. Yeah, I wish it was the other way round. We could do with a trophy shot system where you can actually move the animals around and like rig them where you want. Trophy poses and things like that. Like the Hunter Classic. It would be ideal. So I'd love to have him the other way round for this. So I think what we'll do is we'll have a look at him in the inspect screen. So where did we get him on the first shot? Oh look, we hit the bone. So look his shoulder plate. We hit that and pinged off it. I was a little bit high and a bit to the side of where it wanted to be. But it's hit his shoulder bone and glanced off. So yeah, no kill shot. Let's have a look at the second shot, shall we? Must have been a lung at least. There we go. So nice clean shot on the second shot. What we should have done in the first place. Nice clean shot with a 3-3-8. So let's have a look at the overview. There he is. I love the fur on these. 60, well 60%. 60 so it wouldn't have made anything good anyway. Only a one star. But I just wanted to get an albino. We lost 7 kilo of meat. So not bad for a 3-3-8. Works well on the wood bisons. And here's his trophy details. We're not going to sell him. We're going to taxidermize him. I think we'll inspect him first. Because I want to look at their glorious models. Look how nice they are. The fur is absolutely amazing on these. Really realistic. I like the muscle structure. They look really good. Pink eyes, pink nose. Albino. He's got his fuzzy hairdo. I like the beard as well. I'm just taking a few pictures as I do this because I'll probably use this for Photoshop as well. That's why it's handy, this inspect screen. It's nice to look at the models and the animals, but it's also very useful for people like me. That's perfect. A few more pictures. And what we'll do is we'll go to the trophy lodge and we'll see where we can stick him. I'm not sure actually. Some of the trophy mounts I've not looked at much. It, when I go to visit them is often the first time I've actually seen them. So I don't know what kind of trophy mount it goes on. We're going to find out in a minute. But there you go. Albino wood bison. One of the new furs down. 
Now we want a melanistic moose. That's the next one I'm going to try and get. We might not get him before the update comes out, but we'll keep trying our best. I don't think the update will be too long, but there's no date given yet. Like I said, this is why it's on the test branch, so they can get it as good as possible, as stable as possible, because the last thing you want is more issues. Right. So which one shall we find? Uh, which trophy mount shall we use? We need a big one, because there's a big lad. Ah, what about this one here? I guess we'll soon find out when we click on this. All right, let's have a look at this one. There we go. So it fits on this one. Stick on that. It costs a lot to taxidermize them. Look at that. It's quite a lot of money. But he is a special trophy, isn't he? But we've been taking a look at the update 1.23 on the dev branch on PC. And here is our first rare fur variation, the albino wood bison. What a great trophy. Love the hunt. Started out badly, ended brilliantly. Really enjoyed it. So I'm Ron McTube. We've been playing Where the Hunter. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe to my YouTube channels. And thanks for watching. Bye bye.